combined solid means hemisphere and cylinder both shall be combined after combining both figure volume shall be find out volume shall be find out curved surface area should be find out total area shall be also find out to see here now this is our figure combined solid figure here this lever one given cylinder form and in cylinder this r is radius and this is dotted one is hemisphere both is combined to form a single figure similarly here also we can see that here r is radius of this cylinder and this dotted one is hemisphere both is combined to form single figure in this here l is given and in here this figure h is given here r is given in both of figure after giving all these thing we should find formula or to find formula of volume to find the volume of this figure to find the curved surface area of cylinder to find the total area surface of this figure this figure or this figure any one figure some of the formula shall be used to see here to find the volume of this figure combined solid here combined figure to find the volume of this figure see v equal pi r square in bracket 2 upon 3 r plus h this is also a small one known as parenthesis now in parenthesis we are given 2 upon 3 r plus h in this formula we are used sign pi pi is 22 upon 7 r is radius and h is height in this way using this formula we will easily find the volume of this combined figure solid figure similarly we see here curved surface area curved surface area is also denoted by s s equal 2 pi r plus r plus s 2 pi r into r plus s in fact here in this formula also we have used pi r and s unknown value so pi is also we will denote pi also known as 22 upon 7 r is radius and s is height okay. to find total surface area of this figure here total to find total surface area total surface area is denoted by a a equal pi r in parenthesis 3 r plus 2 h this is our formula to find the total surface area of this combined figure combined solid figure in this formula used pi pi means 22 upon 7 r is radius h is height similarly we see more here also volume can be also we can also get volume we can find volume by using some different formula also see here to find volume Next formula used is given here. The formula is pi r square in parenthesis 2 upon 3 r plus l. Here pi is 22 upon 7, r is radius, l is length. Applying this formula also we will find volume of this figure. As, as we know that s is curved surface area, curved surface area is generated by s, s equal 2 pi r r plus l here in this formula used pi pi means 22 upon 7 r is radius l is length area a is total surface area area means total surface area to so find the total surface area of figure if given l then see here a equal pi r 3 r plus 2 l in parenthesis pi means 22 upon 7 r is radius l means length now all this is formula 1 2 3 4 5 6 all this is formula to find the volume curved surface area total surface area of this combined solid figure if given as this formula shall be used this formula shall be used if provided l in our figure l and r is provided then we'll use this lower formula and if in figure provided h then this formula shall be used using all this formula we will easily find the value of 
our solid figure it may be volume to, to find out volume to find out curved surface area to find out total surface area everything shall be easily calculated by using all this formula they are given us formula for combined solid c math solution if you like this knowledge this formula then please subscribe like and share and press bell icon so that immediate notification you will get of every latest video Here some more formula is given. See here this figure, this figure, figure is something changed here. R is given here both sides. This is Yes and this is L. In this also figure here R, R given and L is given. If L given, H given, formula shall be changed. In this type of formula, here two sides there is hemisphere of cylinder. In the cylinder, both sides is hemisphere joint. This is also half cylinder and both sides is hemisphere joint. In this type of figure, we will use formula to find volume, curved surface area, total surface area. It shall be something different. Let's see. Combine solid here. Volume V. Volume is denoted by V. V equal pi r square 4 upon 3 r plus h in parentheses. Or next formula also we can use V equal pi r square in parentheses 4 upon 3 r plus x here in this formula we have used pi pi means 22 upon 7 r r is radius x x is height and l is length see, similarly we will see our next formula curved surface area is denoted by s s equal 2 pi r in parentheses 2r plus h or s equal 2 pi r 2r plus h this is our formula same thing comes here in this formula so we have used pi r h all these have same meaning as here pi means 22 upon 7 r is radius h is height l length similarly we see here total surface area to find total surface area of this figure this combined figure see here a equal 2 pi r total surface area a means is denoted by a a equal 2 pi r in parenthesis 2 r plus h a equal 2 pi r 2 r plus uh, l here different here also in this formula used here pi is used r is used h is used l is used every have same meaning every formula used pi r l everything have same meaning so also we can say that different letters or alpha used in formula have their usual meaning as you now if you like this then please subscribe like and share or press this bell icon for notification of our latest video given something more in given figure this is our figure given half uh, this is cylinder and on cylinder top portion is hemisphere both is joint to form solid figure now in this figure provided us this is r and this one is s this is height we can also say that this is height and here this is radius r in given figure o in given figure is solid composed of cylinder with a hemisphere on the top if the radius of the base of cylinder is r unit and height of the cylinder is h unit then we have to find see here here radius of a base equal r unit and height of cylinder equal h unit now in total height equal h plus r unit here this r and h shall be added to find total height 
circumference of base base means this lower circle this lower circle is given us r now to find the circumference of this base we have formula 2 pi r unit area of base equal pi r square unit base is our this circle the circle area shall be find the area of this circle our formula is pi r square unit curved surface area equal 2 pi r h plus 2 pi r square square unit here both shall be used here 2 pi r h plus 2 pi r square square unit now total surface area equal 2 pi r h plus 2 pi r square plus pi r square in these three things shall be added Now here, when adding all these three formula, our formula shall be something changed. See here, our formula will be 2 pi r h plus 3 pi r square in parentheses, square unit. Volume formula, volume B equal 2 upon 3 pi r cube plus pi r square h cubic unit. In Volume shall always be written in cubic unit. Using all this formula, we will cal calculate certain thing using formula as provided us H, R, or something different more and much. Now see here question number 258 upon A given. Given figure is solid composed of cylinder with a hemisphere on the top. If the volume of hemisphere is one third of the volume of cylinder and the volume of cylinder is 333 centimeter cube find the total volume of this solid now in this this is our figure here cylinder and hem hemisphere is both is joined now to now we will find the total volume of this figure see here to find the total volume we will use certain formula as discussed above in different way here volume of cylinder given us volume of cylinder given us 333 centimeter cube volume of hemisphere equal 1 upon 3 into volume of cylinder given in our question one third one third of volume of cylinder so volume of hemisphere equal 1 upon 3 into volume of cylinder equal 1 upon 3 into 333 centimeter cube equal 111 centimeter cube now total volume of solid now total volume of solid we know that to, to find the total volume we will add the volume of hemisphere and this cylinder both hemisphere and cylinder both shall be added see here total volume of solid equal volume of cylinder plus volume of hemisphere now 333 centimeter cube is volume of cylinder in question given and 111 centimeter cube is volume of hemisphere we got here 111 centimeter cube so both after adding both we will get 444 centimeter cube so of our required volume total volume of solid 444 centimeter Our next question here 258 upon B given figure is a solid composed of cylinder with a hemisphere on the bottom. If the volume of the hemisphere and cylinder are in the ratio of 3 is to 4 and the total volume of the solid is 777 cm cube, find the total volume of the cylinder. Now this is our figure in figure provided us something and using all these things we will find find the requirement of question.
Now given us here let V1 equal volume of cylinder. Now this one is our cylinder, not color part is our cylinder. That let it be volume one, be volume of cylinder, V2 equal volume of hemisphere. Now this one is added part here. This is hemisphere. Now let the V2 be the volume of hemisphere. From question given of in our question that volume of cylinder and volume of hemisphere both are in ratio given here v2 upon v1 equal 3 upon 4 or also we can say that v2 equal 3 upon 4 into v1 volume 1 again v1 plus v2 equals 777 cm cube uh, this is also given in our question 777 cm cube or v1 plus now value of v2 this one shall be used in place of v2 here comes v1 plus 3 upon 4 v1 equals 777 or v1 plus v2 equals 777 centimeter cube or 7 v1 upon 4 equal 777 therefore v1 equals 777 into 4 this 4 is multiplied here and total is divided by 7 equal 444 centimeter cube the volume of cylinder is 444 centimeter cube in this way we got the requirement of our Here, question number 258 upon B given us given figure is a solid composed of cylinder with a hemisphere on the bottom. If the volume of the hemisphere and cylinder are in the ratio of 3 to 4 and the total volume of the solid is 777 cm cube, find the total volume of the cylinder. Here given cylinder figure is this, this is cylinder and this is hemisphere. Both is attached to form a new figure. Here, uh, Two solid figure is com combined, composed, two cylinder, two solid figure is combined to form single figure. Here upper one is cylinder and lower one is hemisphere. Both hemisphere and cylinder is joined to form single figure. So given in this single figure, some information provided us in our question, we will find out the total volume of cylinder. Now here. Let V1 equal volume of cylinder and V2 equal volume of hemisphere. In this figure, we will assume, we will assume certain things. Here, let V1, V1 be volume of cylinder, this V1 be volume of this lower cylinder and V2 be the volume of hemisphere. This hemisphere, this is hemisphere and V2 cylinder, cylinder means this, volume of this and volume of this, both. Now, from question given in our question in ratio the ratio is 3 is to 4 now given v2 upon v1 equal 3 upon 4 implies that v2 equal 3 upon 4 into v1 again v1 plus v2 equal 777 centimeter cube this also provided us in our question 777 centimeter cube or v1 plus 3 upon 4 v1 here from here it comes from here 3 upon 4 into v1 here v2 is equal to 3 upon 4 v1 same thing comes here in place of v2 comes here 3 upon 4 into v1 equals 777 or same same thing repeated here again v1 plus v2 equals 777 centimeter cube or 7 v1 upon 4 on adding this both we get here 7 V1 upon 4 equals 777 centimeter cube. Therefore, V1 equals 777 into 4 whole upon 7 equals 444 centimeter cube. Thus, the volume of cylinder is 444 centimeter cube. In this way, we find the required volume of our cylinder. In this way, using different formula and different process, we get uh, the volume of cylinder. And this is the requirement of our question. In this way, we solve this question. If you like this video, please subscribe if you are new to this channel. And also press this bell icon for notification of latest video. Thanks.
given us 259 upon a given given figure is a solid composed of cylinder with a hemisphere at the bottom if the curved surface of the hemisphere is one third of the curved surface area of cylinder find relation between r and s yes. here given two figure one is hemisphere and other is cylinder both is attached to form a new figure in uh, in new figure given us some information in our question using all those information we will apply certain formula to find the requirement of our question let's see here csf hemisphere means curved surface area of hemisphere equal one third into csa of cylinder here csm is curved surface area of cylinder this provided in our question or csf hemisphere we have formula 2 pi r square equal 1 upon 3 into 2 pi r h and this is formula of curved surface area of cylinder this is formula for finding curved surface area of hemisphere and this is formula for finding curved surface area of cylinder or r equal 1 upon 3 into h or r equal h upon 3 therefore our relation is h equal 3r is the required relation between height and radius of our new figure that is cylinder and hemisphere in next question here given 259 upon b given figure is a solid composed of cylinder with two hemisphere at the end if the diameter of the hemisphere is equal to the length of cylinder and their product is 196 centimeter square find the total length of the solid in this given something different see here here let this is our figure here both sides attached this is hemisphere this is hemisphere on this is central one is cylinder and hemisphere it attached to both side of cylinder so let's dv the diameter of hemisphere this is hemisphere this is hemisphere and diameter of hemisphere be d let let this we have to assume certain thing here and as be the length of hemisphere from question d equal h and d into h equal 196 centimeter or h square equal 196 therefore h equal 14 centimeter and d equal 14 centimeter given us our equation that h and given us d equal h so once getting the value of h our d will be also same thing that's equal 14 centimeter and d also equal 14 centimeter as given us in our question d equal h r equal d upon 2 we know that radius equal diameter upon 2 r equal d upon 2 equal 14 upon 2 is equal to 7 centimeter total length of solid equal l total length of solid l equal r plus r plus h is equal to 7 plus 7 plus 14 this is radius this is radius and this is height total centimeter is equal to 28 centimeter in this way we get requirement of our second question also see here our next question here our next question given something 259 upon c our next question the area of the curved surface of a solid cylinder is equal to two third of total area of the same cylinder if the total surface of it is 924 square centimeter find the radius and height we have to assume certain things here here let r and h be radius and height of cylinder we assume this then total surface area is equal to 2 pi r r plus h this is our formula from formula we use this that we know that formula formula our formula is 2 pi r r plus s here in formula pi means 22 upon 7 2 is from formula r is radius and s is height or given our equation 924 here 924 given 924 equal 2 pi r square plus 2 pi r here. same is extended so here expanded and we have to assume this let it be equation first again curved surface area our next formula curved surface area is equal to 2 pi r h or 
2 upon 3 into 924 is equal to 2 pi r s or 616. On solving this, we get here 616 is equal to 2 pi r s. Let it be equation 2. Putting the value of 2 pi r s in 1. Here, putting the value of this 2 pi r s in 1. 2 pi r s, here also 2 pi r s, and here also 2 pi r s. Value is 616 of this 2 pi r s. Same thing we will place in our equation 1. This value will place it in equation 1. On putting the value of 2 pi r s in equation 1, we get putting the value of 2 pi r s in equation 1, we get 2 pi r s square plus 616. Value of 2 pi r s is equal to 924 or 2 pi r square is equal to 924 minus 616. Now, this is subtracted from this 924 or 2 pi r square is equal to 308 or r square is equal to 308 upon 2 pi or r square is equal to 308 into 7 whole upon 2 into 22 or r square is equal to 49 therefore r equal 7 centimeter on getting the value of r r means radius on getting the value of radius we will put get something new putting the value of r in equation 2 we have here 616 is value here 2 pi r s is equal to 616 we are putting the value of r here we will get 616 is equal to 2 into 22 upon 7 into 7 into x or 616 is equal to 44 x therefore s equal to s is equal to 616 upon 44 is equal to 14 centimeter thus our thus here r is equal to 7 centimeter and height s is equal to 7 14 centimeter and this is our required solution in this way we got solution of this Question number 260 upon A. Given us the curved surface area of cylinder whose height is equal to radius of, of the base is 2464 square centimeter. Find the total surface area of the cylinder. Given here in this question, here R be the radius and S the height of cylinder. Let we have to assume certain thing to solve this question. We have let means we assume certain thing that R be the radius of cylinder and S be the height of cylinder. Since height is equal to radius, that is R equal is equal to S. From formula or by formula, curved surface area of cylinder is equal to 2 pi R S and this is our formula. 2 pi R S is formula to find the curved surface area of cylinder. 2 pi R S or given our in equation, 2464 or 2464 centimeter square is equal to 2 pi r into r here r s in place of s we place here r putting s equal r so we can easily place that r in place of s or 2464 centimeter square is equal to 2 pi r square therefore pi r square is equal to 2464 upon 4 upon 2 centimeter square is equal to 1232 centimeter square again by using our next formula by formula total surface area of cylinder is equal to 2 pi r r plus s is equal to 2 pi r r plus r is equal to 2 pi r plus into 2 r here r plus r is 2 r so again here multiplied 2 r is equal to 4 r 4 pi r square is equal to now value of pi r square is 2 by 32 centimeters square same thing we will place after 4 4 into 12 32 is equal to 49 28 centimeter square and this is our requirement of our question so total surface area of cylinder is 49 28 centimeter square and this is requirement of our question or we can also say that this is our required solution Question number 260 upon B. Given figure is combined solid made of cylinder and hemisphere. If 
total height of the solid is 13 cm and diameter of the hemisphere is 14 cm find the volume of solid here this is our hemisphere here combined solid combined solid of hemisphere lower one is hemisphere and this upper one is cylinder both is combined to form new figure or new solid figure given given here question here diameter is equal to 14 centimeter given us in our question 14 centimeter diameter is 14 centimeter and so radius r is equal to d upon 2 equal 14 upon 2 is equal to 7 centimeter total height is equal to 13 centimeter so height of cylinder as equal to 13 minus 7 is equal to 6 centimeter now total volume is equal to volume of volume d means volume of cylinder plus volume of hemisphere both volume shall be added from formula we know that volume of cylinder to find the volume of cylinder we have formula pi r square h plus volume of hemisphere is 3 2 upon 3 pi r cube is equal to pi r square h plus 2 upon 3 r is equal to pi r square h plus 2 upon 3 r is equal to 22 upon 7 into 7 square 6 plus 2 upon 3 into 7 is equal to 154 into 32 upon 3 is equal to 16 42.67 centimeter cube the total volume of solid is 1642.67 centimeter cube and this is our required solution Here question number 260 upon C given us. Given solid object is made up of a cylinder and a hemisphere whose radius of base is 7 cm and total height is 14 cm. Find the volume of the object. Here common radius R is equal to 7 cm and total